In this video, I'm going to show you how to offer local SEO, search engine optimization, as a service for local businesses and make it an absolute no-brainer for them at such a low cost entry point with minimal work for you to do and add value massively to the business. They're going to come, they're going to use your software, they're going to love it and they're going to massively reduce churn. They're going to stay with you because the results you're going to offer are going to be so, so simple. So you're going to tell them that you will offer local SEO. There are a lot of companies out there offering local SEO for $1,000, $1,500, $2,000. Now that's a lot of money, particularly for a small business. But you can come and offer this effectively for free if they use your software. Now, we're using High Level as our back end here. You can see up here that we're using Closing Boost. This is our white label version of High Level. If you don't know what High Level is, if you haven't used it, then please go to theprofitpact.com. I'll put the link under this video. We will give you all the free training. We'll give you access to an exclusive 30 day free trial link. Normally you only get 14 days and we will show you how to build and scale your business from scratch. We will give you our snapshots. It's basically loading all the content into your account in a couple of clicks so you've got it already done for you already there it's all free no tricks no scams no upsells we're giving this away for free because they say give away your best stuff so we had a few beers and we thought screw it let's do it we're giving it away so go check that out right i'm going to dive in i'm going to show you how to do it how you can quickly simply easily set up local seo for businesses then it's going to be a no-brainer so let's say you're selling your software i mean you could go as low as 97 dollars, but our, our lowest price we sell for is um 167 we've got another package at 267 and then a 497 now to entice businesses to get them in say hey jump in on my you know whatever it is let's say it's a 167 or a 267 package i'm going to offer you local seo for free now this normally sells at 1500 dollars a month um i'm going to offer it to you for free you're going to have to do a tiny 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 bit of the work but i'm going to show you how to do it uh, um, and then you've got local seo for free you're going to save yourself uh, um you know about 1300 dollars a month I mean, it's going to be a no-brainer. Why do we want local SEO? What's in it for them? Why do they need it? Well, you know, 50% of traffic goes to the number one um, spot on Google. 50%, the one at the top gets 50%. Um, of the rest, it's then about 30% um, for number two, uh, and, and then it goes down. But the, the top few spots are key. So you want, they need to be up there. Someone's searching for a restaurant, a plumber, whoever it is, they need to be up there because they will get so, so, so much more traffic and so much more business. So how do we do that? How do we encourage Google to make sure that they're going to be there? How are you going to offer this? Now, it takes a little bit of time, which is another reason that they're going to need to stay with you and do it. But the first thing we're going to do is we're going to enable um, Google Business. Um, it's referred to as Google My Business and Google Business. They changed their name from Google My Business to Google Business. But we're going to set up Google Business messaging and we're literally going to hit this button here we're going to come into launchpad we're going to hit this button and we're going to connect their google business account and then in like one click uh uh, uh maybe it's two um it's going to integrate once once you put that across it's connected to their google business account it's going to turn on messaging in their account and the messaging is then going to come into our universal inbox universal inbox is going to be here this is just a test account so the, you know there's nothing in 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 here at all but you know we're going to have this universal inbox where everything is in here they're going to see it messages will come through Google business loves messaging. Um, why? It's, in, it's a new product for them. Um, secondly, Google business, um, if you're messaging from Google business, you're staying on their platform. So Google want to keep people on the platform doing more and more on their platform. So that's good for them. Also, if we're messaging uh, um, and you're responding, customers like that. Uh, a lot of people want to, want to chat now rather than pick up the phone, rather than fill out a contact form, they want to chat. So if you're responsive on that and we can set up automation using workflows to quickly respond to them. So the, the, the potential customer is gonna have a good experience. So they're gonna like that and Google surveys them. So they get, uh, they get a, a quick response and it's simple and easy to respond. You can then set up notifications for your client that it comes through on an app on their phone so they can be out and about and, and responding. But of course we can have automation that responds with a, a, f a few keywords 
keywords and gives them the basic info that, that people normally ask for. So we can quickly and easily set up Google Business Messaging and people will stay on Google, people will get good satisfaction, Google will, will then push you up the rankings. So when people are searching for you, Google's gonna push you up because they know you look after your customers, you're using their messaging feature, people are staying on Google, all these little signals really, really help Google and they want to push you up. Um, so over time, that's gonna push you up the rankings just by connecting that and being responsive. Okay, what's the next thing? Let's move my head over to the side and it's called Yext. Uh, um, and let's come down here to Launchpad. Give your business the vi visibility it deserves today. List your business of 70 plus portals and, and boost SEO instantly. And it, and it is pretty quick. So come here, you, you click here, there's a little bit of a video and then behind it you can start to see uh, um, you know, a, a graph of all these places that the, it's going to submit you to, and here it says it's ninety nine dollars a month. Now, high level actually charge you thirty bucks a month. So whether you're um, gonna gonna bundle this and just give it to them, um, or whether you're going to, you know, so we do a markup, so um, we get what sixty nine dollars a month out of this, and it gives a whole bunch of backlinks to it. So this gives gives Google and your other search engines uh, um, a whole bunch of information saying, hey, they're listing this, so this must be a genuine business, it must be good. But the other key feature is what it does is it makes sure that the phone number is the same on each one, that the, the address is the same, the business name is the same. It gets confusing if, if it, you get bad signals to Google if all those are mixed, but if they're the same, then it gives extra power to the search engines to say, you know, they're spending time making sure this is all correct. So they're obviously interested in, in this, they're obviously a good business. They're working on this, they're doing it properly and it boosts SEO. So this is a monthly fee to make sure that continually stays up to, up to date and whether you're passing that cost on to the customers or whether you're eating that cost yourself as part of, as part of your service, um, you can still, you know, in, in one click and you get the business to submit their, their info to make sure it is all correct, um, that can all be done. And if you know, their, their phone number change, they move location, whatever, then you can update it here and it will update it across everywhere as well. So that's gonna to continue to do that. So um, that's, that's that. Okay, let's, let's look at the next thing. Let's look at reputation management here. Uh, let me put my head down here. The next thing is reputation management. Um, so um, there, are, there are four things we have done. Google business messaging. We've done Yex with the citations. Now we're on reputation management. Now with this third thing, there's an A and there's a B. Um, um, so there are two aspects. One is responding to reviews. So re reviews come in and we respond to them. Well, once we've connected Google Business, we'll actually, in, in the conversations where we were earlier, um, they, they'll, they'll come in here and you can quickly respond into the conversations here, super quick, super simple to respond. So uh, we want to make sure that we are responding to reviews super super important every single review whether it's positive whether it's negative we should respond to them and do that it shows google that you care it shows the customer that you care it shows people looking at the reviews that you care uh, um, so it, it's good all around respond to them google will push you up um, so it's it's good all around for that so that's one responding to the reviews but the other one is setting up a quick campaign that's going to reach out to customers to get reviews so you can get uh, on the customer's database uh, um, and upload that add them into a uh, automation that will send out reviews to them and then continually as more customers come in just we can automate the system of reaching out to them and saying hey thanks for coming into my med spa to my chiropractor to uh, thanks thanks for the plumbing work that we just did thanks that we unblocked your your, your toilet thanks that we uh, you know we just cleaned up the um, the cat puke on your carpet did did your carpet uh, um, would you leave did we do a good job would you leave us a review and so we're getting to now massively increase the number of reviews that they get well of course people like seeing reviews and like seeing rather than you having three reviews over the last two years um, you constantly getting reviews every every day every week and then suddenly instead of having three in total you you've got 333 you know wow suddenly this is a good business doing well with a 4.2 star rating with that many reviews this is good i'm going to go there google like it because people keep telling them this is a good business this is a good business this is a good business google wants to promote the good businesses where people are going to have a good experience not the ones that only have a couple of reviews so you can't really tell the ones that have a lot and a high star rating who are they going to push up they're going to push 
those ones up. So this is another thing that Google uh, uh, look at and are going to help push you up. And again, we can engineer making that happen with this automation. Super, super cool. So that's going to push up. So those are the two aspects of rep reputation management. Uh, last thing is Google My Business posting. Uh, we should be posting uh, a minimum of once a week on Google Business, and it's simple. We're going to come here to Marketing. We're going to go to Social Planner. We're going to connect the accounts. We can do Facebook groups, Facebook pages, um, Instagram, Google Business, LinkedIn, uh, Twitter, TikTok. Um, but the key one here for the SEO bit is just tell them, okay, come in here. We're going to link your Google Business. Once a week, I need you to make a Google Business post. Ideally, do more. Now, actually, while you're in here, why don't you then check the boxes and post them on your on your page on your instagram on your linkedin on your twitter on your tiktok you know whatever whatever it might be why don't you post them on the other platforms while you're in there you just got to check a couple of boxes and it will post them on them all um, but definitely at least once a week do that now you know that's going to take you uh, um, to set up the month's worth of posting probably um, 20 minutes a month you're going to come in you're going to do you know maybe the first Tuesday of every month, you're going to come in and set up your month's worth of posting. You know, you need four posts, one a, one a, one a week for the month. Put them up there um, and you've got posting in there because Google will see that you're active, that you're doing stuff um, at least once a week. You should be posting on Google Business. Now, do these four things and uh, suddenly you've got a local SEO package that businesses are charging $1,000, $2,000 for, um, for doing those four things. This software will do it all, set up a quick bit of automation, get the client to do a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of work like the social posting, um, but they're going to save themselves over $1,000 a month um, just for doing that. Who wouldn't want to do that? And if they really, really don't want to do it and can't be bothered, then you can do it for a small upcharge or hire a VA to do it for them. Um, and, and, and you know, you could, you could charge them a small bit for that. Say, I'm going to give you this $1,500 package and I'll do it all for you, um, for 500 bucks. No brainer still. And boom, um, all of, all, all, all of that is done for them. Um, and they get this local SEO package. They're going to get a ton more business. Now, of course, it takes time to move up the rankings. Google need to need to see that this is consistent over time, and we're going to do so. So, don't think next week it's suddenly going to make a, a a big difference. But look at it now. Look at it in three months' time, and it will make a difference. Um, and they are going to push up there, and they are going to get a load more business. So make sure um, that you do this for your clients. Walk in. It is a no-brainer offer when you know. People are pitching this service for 1500 bucks, and you can do it for next to nothing for them. Um, so it really is a no-brainer when you, they think of it in those terms and how it can really catapult their business and get more traffic, more more, more people in the door, more people scheduling with them, um, booking, booking appointments and paying them for whatever the business or service is that they offer. Now, if you like this, please do me a favor, smash that like button, drop a, drop a comment, share it, all of that good stuff. Um, if you want to know how you can set all of this up for yourself, then go to The Profit Pact, P-A-C-T dot com, um, and we've got all the free training there. We've got a free Facebook group. Um, would love to have you as part of it. We will show you how you can build and scale your SaaS business. Get the 30-day free trial. We'll show you during those 30 days how you can get clients to pay you more than the cost that you will then have to pay after the 30 days of that software. Um, so you don't have to shell out any money out of pocket. And then after that, you're just going to start building and scaling your business. And of course, we'll help you to minimize churn so that customers don't leave. So you're adding more customers per month than, um, than eventually leave. Um, so you're building and building and building your business, paying you monthly recurring revenue. And that's key. It's not one-off payments, but it's monthly recurring revenue coming in. And then we'll show you the other little bits where you can make even more money, such as the rebilling on phone and email costs and that sort of thing. And those and you know those fees can start to add up and start to increase your profit margin on top of that all for free no tricks no scams no upsells we've got all of that stuff so please do go check it out theprofitpack.com and if you haven't smashed that like button go smash it now okay thanks everybody and lastly most importantly have an awesome day